on What's happening, what's cracking, man? It's your boy, man, Dave Bo, a.k.a. Lil' Day, man. We back. We got that Jack TV, man. Feel like you've been a little minute with his girlfriend sleep with his day one homie? Hey. I'm a victim of A. Right. Jack TV. My Welcome bad. back to another Let's episode to on Jack TV. Me and the team flew to Miami to put Izzy's boyfriend to a loyalty test. I haven't really suspected him for cheating, mm -hmm. but it's a big move. I just want to make sure. All alone, he is. I think. So, like I was telling before we met up, uh, my partner for like 11 years. What's good about Jack? Lee. Good little dirt. Yeah. Okay, yes. Welcome back to another episode on Jack TV. Tayshawn wants to put his girlfriend to a loyalty test because he feels she is taking a liking to his homie who trains her in the gym and their relationship is starting to make him feel uncomfortable. So, uh, you know, he used to be my trainer and now he trained my girl. And now it seems uh -huh. like she's just booking a lot of more sessions with him or whatever. And it makes me a little uncomfortable. And uh, I told him about it. He don't agree with me. But, you know, I still want to, you know, check it out for myself and see what's up. Yeah. So do y'all, why, why don't you work out as frankly as you used to? Uh, business just boom and I just don't have time, you know what I'm saying? I'll be on the move a lot. Yeah. So when he came to you and told you, you know what I'm saying, that he feel like the girl's getting a little bit too close to you, how did that make you feel? I don't know. I hope it's nothing more than what it is. Bro, let me find out he crushing his girl, bro. That's his day one homie, man. Hey, we gonna talk about it if he is. Mm -hmm. but I'm being he professional ain't. with mine, you know. Yeah. I take my business very seriously. Yeah. Shit. Oh. We should go ahead and go ahead and start setting up right now. Ricardo, you can go ahead and start uh, setting the cameras in the gym and shit like that. So when we get to the command center, uh, you can be able to hear everything that we're saying from Good inside job. of there. And you know, you just go through your regular routine. Okay. So how, how, how you would train her regularly, just do that, but towards the end, throw your own shit in there and see if she gonna go for it. Hey, Sean had already briefed me on this information, which is why we chose the day that Ariel requested for the session to be at her apartment gym to conduct this test. Since we have all the information ahead of time, it was pretty simple for myself and the team to get inside the oh, apartment snap. gym and set up the cameras. After Mike and Ebeline, it was time to get Tayshawn last thoughts on the do's and don'ts. So I know we already discussed the do's and don'ts, but is there actually anything you don't want him to do while he's conducting the test? Nah, anything go, man. Yeah. They say that now. Cold, uh... yeah. All right, so you can go ahead, bro, and get in the position. She should be here in like the 10 minutes. For sure. Probably got the camera set up. For sure. Let's say everything set up, bro. Like, just imagine you thought your girlfriend was cheating on you, right? Yeah. And I'm your partner. Yeah. And I ask you, I mean, and you be like, hey, fool, can you be the decoy and see? Like, get you know what I'm saying? That's not lying, bro. Nah, for real. Would you do that shit? Man, what? That's crazy, yes, bro. Yeah, that's what they know. Will Tayshawn's girlfriend Ariel remain loyal, or will she fail and try to get with his homie what? Lee? Let's find out now on Jack TV. Yeah. <laughs> All right, bro, there she goes. Here we go. How you doing? I'm oh my, swag. that's bro, mm -hmm. that's no, no, that's the insta red flag. That's all you needed to see. I'm not gonna lie, that's all you need to see. She walk in and want a hug. This is supposed to be professional business. That's how you know they already comfortable. They probably already, but hey, we gonna, hey, we gonna see, bro. I don't know. I guess she blind to that, but come in and giving a hug. She look like she wanted that, like, like now. Hey, right, bro, there she goes. How you doing? I'm being yourself. You smell like weed. Yeah. You been smoking? Okay. Why are you smoking for the workout? Nah, and she fried. You been smoking? Me. She came to the gym hard. Alright, uh, you know what I'm saying. She always so smoking, man. Stretch two minutes. You could definitely tell she work out, though. I'm not gonna lie, like, it looked like she work out. I'm been alright, you know, just working, working hard, training, and trying to cut down on his weight. <laughs> yep, summertime coming. <laughs> summertime, huh? Yep, yep, yep. Trying to lose maybe like 20 pounds. Yeah, leaving my dog about 11 years now. Dang. So it wouldn't make sense only for him to do it. I want to be I feel like ready. feeling them and shit, so. How long you been with Ariel? Man, that can about ruin friendships. Years. Yeah. Yep, yep. I don't even got to lie. I almost just blew my own. It must be the weed. You need to stop smoking. Not at least not at least not before. Is that ice out. spice in the back, bro? Ice spice there, bro. They need to, bro. They need to, uh, uh, cause she do be working out, and I ain't. That's crazy. I did not know ice spice was there. 
At least not that. Can you do that for me? Don't do that no more. I'll, I'll try. That almost. All right. I'll, I'll try. I'm gonna try. But no, I'm ready. I'm here. I'm here. I came here for a reason. Okay. Okay. All right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to do step ups, okay? Yeah. I know we haven't done a step up, so I'm going to show you real quick, okay? Yeah. We haven't done these yet, so. Come here, bam. Come back down. Same leg, okay? Same leg. Man, you're not supposed to be doing that on that, is you? Come back down. We're going to do it in the middle right here. I don't want you to put your foot right here. So I don't want you to trip, okay? Because you're already high. Outside of them working out in the gym, do they do anything? Oh, my God. Uh, not to my knowledge. So if they do, I don't know about it. Mm. You, say <laughs> you sitting down right now? I'll sit down. Come on, That's man. <laughs> you tired and y'all ain't even do nothing. But you come here for like, you came here to get better, to work out. I came here because I want to talk. To talk? About what? Uh-oh. She talking about I came because I wanted to talk. What you talking about, Tay? That's what I'm talking about. He ain't been out. He ain't been with y'all. He been out here? When? I right, spice he going here. crazy. Anyways, he be out here. He's he's a good dude. Like he's cool. He's straightforward. He grinding, doing what he's supposed to be doing. But he doing that with other people. He not even showing me no attention. Like. And he flashy and all that. Like he always trying to throw money in my face, trying to make up for the. Bullshit that he be doing at home. Bro, this is low key pillow talking. I'm not even gonna lie to you, bro. Is this pillow talking or am I tripping? On the girl side, though. Because, like, how are you gonna come to the homeboy to fake work out and talk about your man to your homeboy? Talking low key down on him, too. Talking about he too flashy, trying to throw money in my face. Like, bro, come on, man. For what he's not doing at home. You know, I get money. I guess, so, I guess. We know, we know. You get money, you get money, you get money. Yeah, we know this. It's like, I don't want that. I don't, I don't need that. Like, I'll, you know how long we've been together. Yeah. And you know that we done been through some shit. Mm hmm And we've been trying to grow, but it's like, ain't no growing here. Every time we try to grow, it's, we don't even make it there. Like, we always stop in the tracks because it's like I hear him, but he don't ever hear me. Mm -hmm. It goes in one ear, and it comes out. Yeah, hey, I'm telling y'all, them relationships be hard, boy. Y'all in a real committed, long term relationship, man. Just listen to her talk about this shit, man. I don't even want to hear it, man. That shit is draining for real, bro. When, when you're not going, like when you're not dealing with that, bro, you feel such like a free man or, like, or female. But like, why is she been and opening up to? The trainer, bro. He he, trying to work out, bro. Like, say I'm just trying to talk to him and tell him how I feel. Like he gets so over him. Okay. And it be like, well, what do I? Why am I even talking right now? Like, why do I even have to say anything? You know what I mean? No. So you, so basically, you just here for stress right now. You know, you trying to use just like a stress reliever. Yeah, and I. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you about to cry and shit? You about to cry and shit? Come on, man. Yeah, most what of this shit she's saying we ain't never even talked about. Like, I work a lot, man. I got businesses and shit, so. Yeah. So he really became an ear in the gym for her. Yeah, shoulder to cry on the scene, like. It seemed that Ariel wasn't really in the mood to work out. She just kept talking. What about what you saying? Like, and we've always, we've always had a connection through, you say, like, and <laughs> honestly, I feel like I can come talk to you, and I appreciate you for even booking this section and still being here, you know. I do no working out. <laughs> like, I appreciate that. No, I'm going to show this my job. Like, trying to be... She basically trying to say... You, make sure y'all good. Because y'all good, we good. You know what I mean? That's how we get to y'all results. Can I get a hug? Yeah. Oh, my... I bro. Know what? You see what I'm saying, bro? Yeah, she on some other shit, though. Yeah, she's basically she's basically there to get crushed. Like, she's trying to get crushed, right? She coming to the homeboy for a little lean on the shoulder. She's trying to lean on the shoulder. Then open up to him and say, like, can we crush? Uh, basically. 
Thank you. I appreciate that. You can honestly tell that she feels comfortable enough to vent to Leah about Tayshawn and her relationship. But do you guys consider this a red flag? Your significant other confiding in his or her best friend about problems within y'all relationship. Comment down below on what you guys think. Hey. Why? Right. She job fat as yeah. shit though. Oh, I'm like, let's see. Let's start over. Let's see how I feel. All right. You want to start from the beginning? Yeah. All right. So you going to come down here? Come on, fall down. Just come in and stretch. Remember how we did it before? Just, just stretch, but I want you to go deeper, okay? I'm a, I got you. I'm going to got you. You're behind that little brother. There you go. <laughs> so, put my hat to the back. Yeah, so lay down. Yeah, dive in that motherfucker like right Brad. Yeah. Alright. So you gonna point this toe right here, okay? <laughs> you laughing what you now? What laughing for? Yeah. Alright, gonna tighten it. <laughs> so you just bite your lip? No. Come on now. Yeah, this oh, what yeah. she come for. Right there? <laughs> He basically watching his bitch get crushed. <laughs> what's up, like, what is this? He this watching his bitch like, get crushed. That ain't funny though. I mean, you just be looking at me, you know what I mean? I've just been like, coming here high now. Okay. You heard me for you guys, like you want me. Like, what's, what's popping? I know. What? I feel like you've been looking at me too. I can see when you be side eyeing me. Say shit. You see? That's what I mean. When you come in here with these tights on, you know what I'm saying? I'll be professional with it, but. It's a gym. So you on you 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 ain't feeling me at all. I don't know. Maybe. Kind of. So what are we gonna do about oh. it? What are we gonna do about it? Oh shit. <laughs> what are we gonna do about it? Get you over No. <laughs> okay, I got you. Oh, uh, thank you. Give me, give me, give me a hug, give me a hug. Bro, it's weird as fuck even watching him touch on her, bro. Mm. That motherfucker soft. Oh! Know, bro. <laughs> he did. <laughs> he low key dead wrong. Hey, this is homeboy? Hey, is this day one homie? He did say anything goes, but you even feeling comfortable doing that, knowing he. And look how she all up on, bro, low key, yeah. bro. Damn, he grabbing a shit. Uh, and she just let me. I kiss you. <laughs> For real, bro. He grabbing that. Bro, he, bro, I, he, bro, bro. <laughs> he been wanting to do that for so long. That motherfucker died. Stop it. Shit. Oh. oh bro. Mm -hmm. That motherfucker <laughs> fall. I ain't gonna lie. Don't let me fall now. Damn, he grabbing the shit out of her ass. And she just let him. I catch you. Oh, my you gosh. Mm -hmm. What you gonna do with it when you catch it? Yeah. Look how comfortable she is with that shit. I'm not gonna lie, that was hard to watch, putting myself in touch. <laughs> do y'all see Jack TV face, bro? Bro, that was hard to watch. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Just knowing that his that's his homeboy, like, now I would low-key, bro, I don't know if I would feel a type of way, but if I was him, I would low-key feel a type of way. Like, damn, you my... Damn, even though I say anything goes, but like, damn, you look like, man, you look like you been ready to do that, or y'all just been doing that or some type of shit, you know what I'm saying? Now, she was, and I was his like, best friend. Geez. I just don't think I would have took it they that far. That but once again, comment down below what you guys think. I'm going to catch it, hold it, pick it back up. Squat. Control. All right, man, come on. That's yeah, enough, bro. Okay, That's enough, bro. So you, you want to go in there? Yeah, let's go. Hey, Sean had seen enough, and this was a good time to stop it, in my opinion, before more happened. But now it was time really? to go in and let Ariel know she was on a loyalty test the whole entire time. Stay tuned for more. Here we go. This is what you want, my partner? This is what you want, dog? 
Is so what you want, my partner? You. My partner, you that green? This what you want? You that green? Coming up here with cameras in my face? What's up? Look at what you doing, dog. What's Look up what with that, man? Man, I've been getting money. You been getting money? I've been getting money. You been getting bitch. I've been getting money. I've been paying for this shit. That's what I've been doing. That's what I've been doing. Check the account. That's crazy. Because your money don't That's go crazy. Look, look, my closet. Look, I ain't going to I ain't gonna yell at I you. I don't need your money for no bills. I ain't going to disrespect you. Okay, don't. But you got to get your shit and roll. You already know what's up. Nigga, my name. You already know what's up. That's my shit. Nigga. Bro. That's my shit. shit. When did it become That's your shit? That's my shit. That's been my shit. Since when? Been my shit. Since when? Look, get your shit and just Nigga, go. Nigga, bring out the paperwork and stop Get your down. shit and just go. Nigga, if this just is what go. you wanted from the beginning, you should never go. did this shit. Just Nigga, go. you the one that came up in here. Just get your fucking shit with go. all these different bitches not coming home. Yeah, Nigga, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been talked to you about how I felt. Nigga, this is the result. I've been getting money. Every That's what I've been she on. She said this yeah. is the result. Man, I don't know. She over here making it seem like she popping her shit. Like, yeah, I did. Like, like. I don't know. I guess she felt like he was cheating and shit out with the bitches. He said he getting money. She thinks she out with that bitches. So she said this was the result, man. He probably ain't real sure enough. Reaction. I've been getting money. That's what I've been on. You don't want for shit, do you? Nigga. You don't want for nothing, do you? Nigga, I I'm doing my job. You. I'm doing my job. Okay. Man, you got to get your shit and go. You can do your shit. You got to get your shit and go. You got to get your shit. You got to get your shit and go. Nigga. Let's go. Let's roll. Nigga, and you not Let's even go. addressing your homeboy. This nigga yeah, in on it. He in on it. He's a decoy. So, area the whole entire time? Oh, you was in on this shit, too. Dumb. <laughs> no, for real, though. Like, I was, like, she was right. You not even checking your homeboy, but, I mean, he was in on it, but at the same time, he did. I don't know, man. Y'all let me know how y'all feel. Did he go too far or what? He in on it. He's a decoy. So, area the whole entire time? Oh, you was in on this shit, too. Dumbass. Oh, Wow. Yo. Yo. Hey, the whole entire time you was on a loyalty test. Yo. The whole entire time. So he was just coming in here to Yo. See Yo. <laughs> Yo. Spanked her, dumbass. Yo. Now that you was just like all about my ass, nigga, you was, you was damn near touching my... Like, are you serious? Oh. It was a part. Like, you, so, as your friend, you gonna let him do that? Like, you cool with that? That's what y'all do, y'all booty buddies or something, huh? As my girl, you let that happen? Yeah. Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. All right, let's make it official. Get your shit and get the fuck out. Nigga, you get your shit and get your shit out. Get your shit out. Come on. I'm not finna keep talking to you. I'm not finna keep talking to you. I spice in the cut. I'm not finna keep talking to you. I'm not finna keep talking to you. I Look, you getting out my shit. Nigga, you gonna have Regardless of anything. Regardless of anything, you shaking. Talk your shit. Talk your shit. Do what you want for these cameras. You shaking. You shaking. These cameras. You nigga, stay. So Aria, why did you wanna why did you wanna mess with him in the first place? Honestly, he's been a realest thing in this entire relationship between me and him. And honestly, I actually fuck with you. And the fact that you think you're acting like, oh, you doing this shit for the motherfucking camera. Stop fucking playing, bro. I feel like her I feel like the reason she was getting more and more um workout sessions with him because she was opening up to him and he probably was a good person to vent to. When they was working out and shit, and she he probably made her feel comfortable. They probably wasn't crushing, but you know how you can go to that one person and talk about your relationship with, and they know everything about it, and then they just easier to talk to them. I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. That's, so that's probably why I don't know. Stop fucking playing because, like I say, nigga, all those fucking looks that you've been giving me. So you so you feel like you feel like it's mutual between y'all two. Yeah. Nigga, and I feel like you over here doing all this because it don't even matter. It don't even matter. Nigga, you wouldn't have been doing none of this shit with him for him if it wasn't because this one you want to be. It don't even wild. matter. But it don't even matter. The camera, Look, the camera, and I bet you come back up to my room when all this shit is done. I bet you gonna be upstairs. And that's cool. That's and cool. You supposed to owe me loyalty. And your shit. Never, right. never check the pimp. Check the. You did. Now at this point, it's hard to tell if all of what Ariel is saying is true or not, and is she saying these things out of spite? However, in her going on with her rent, feeling that everything was mutual between Lee and her, when all this shit is done, I bet you gonna be upstairs. He not once said anything to defend himself, nor did he deny that the things were mutual between the two of them. Instead, he just kind of stayed quiet. He could possibly be a non-confrontational individual, but I think those allegations definitely deserve a conversation between him and Tayshawn of some sort. 
She probably spilling all the real tea out where he ain't trying to say nothing because he really been on that from the get-go. His bro just don't know. And he trying to act like, man, hey, this is a two-way bad street right here, boy. I'm done, man. I'm done. I'm straight. Based on what Ariel is saying, do you guys feel like Lee is spilling her outside of the test? Let me know down in the comments below. Probably, man. So... It's a, it's a few things I want to address real quick. So, why why was she saying so, like why was she saying those things? Like why did she feel like it was mutual? She she just on because she got busted. How you feel about her saying that? I mean it's all good even if it was man you know what I'm saying like. It's all good. For sure. You know what I'm saying? For sure. Yeah, I feel like he being honest. Oh, yeah, that's the best shit. Yeah, I, sure. I was just asking, you know what I mean? just a question for what I heard. Sure, you got the answers you on it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. I appreciate y'all, though. Oh. Sure, bro. All right, sure, man. Y'all be safe. After everything, Tayshawn got his answers, which was the goal, and didn't really even seem to be worried about Lee's intentions. He just kind of brushed it off. I know what bro. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to the That's channel because we're on a road to a million. Stay tuned for more. How would y'all feel if y'all was in his shoes, man? Hey, y'all let me know how y'all feel about this video. That was a crazy little interesting kind of bit, man. We out!